What's up guys and welcome back to another video. Um today I'm going to show you what is a CPU exactly. So I've just done a video on RAM, which is random access memory, and um, you should probably watch that first because that kind of goes along with this. I mean, or it doesn't really matter. You can watch this, then that, and then the next ones that come along, or it really doesn't matter. But, um, you know, never mind. Just forget what I said. <laughs> okay, so a c CPU is like, okay, so if you know what RAM is, well, you need to know what RAM is first, so pause this video and go look for that one on my channel. If you just go to the domain S, hit the home tab, when you scroll all the way down, it should be somewhere around there. So, um, yeah. I'm gonna give you a second there. Okay, so, a CPU stands for Central Processing Unit. So, Basically, how I was saying in the other video, if you open something, it stores in your RAM. Um, this is what makes it open, basically. So, like, if I open... Wait, now, let me get that out of there. If I open this app called CPUX, if I hit that, not only is it stored in the RAM right now, but it just used the CPU to go through it and open it. So, um... Yeah. <laughs> now, I'll show you. I am using a Samsung Galaxy S9. So, my CPU is a Snapdragon 845, that's right, with 8 cores, which I'll explain in another video what cores is, and then 2.8 gigahertz. And I'll also explain in another video what gigahertz is. So, right there. And, um, okay, so I'm going to stop this clip and think of a way to explain it better than what I have in mind. So I'll be back. Okay, so I've gave I've given myself a couple minutes to think. Basically the CPU is the whole core of your device. Like think of it as the mother of the device. And the CPU is the one that does all of like the thinking. Like for example it handers <laughs> Handles rendering and 3D graphics processing and other stuff, but those are just two examples. And then, um, at its core, a CPU can take instructions from a program or an application and perform a calculation. So, this process can be broken down into three key, sta key, key stages. Fetch, decode, and execute. And what I mean by that is a CPU fetches the instruction from a system's RAM, which you should probably go watch that RAM video. Then it decodes what the instruction actually is before it is executed by the relevant parts of the CPU. So, it's what, it's basically, it does anything, it helps with anything from starting up your PC or your phone or your tablet from, to, like, to watching a YouTube video. So, um, yeah, that's basically what a CPU is. It's just like the thinking part. It thinks all the stuff through. So, um, yeah, guys, if you have any questions or anything you want to ask me about a computer or anything, just let me down, le let me know in the comments below, and I will answer it as soon as I can. So, uh, yeah, guys, hope this answered your question, and, um, hope it helped you, so, hope you enjoyed, and, uh, peace.